Hey guys, RC here. We're back with episode 23 of our Journeyman Save. We're playing FM 18. Wanted to uh, sh share some news with you. So Adrian Petrie, uh, in that last match, last episode, scored that goal 14 seconds into the match. If you have not seen it, you ought to pause this, go check it out, and then come back. Uh, we'll wait for you. We're not going anywhere. Uh, but that set a new team record, as well as being the fastest goal in Swedish Premier Division history. So the previous was 28 seconds. So very, very happy. And actually, that was earlier this year. So didn't last very long. Uh, we have been pretty active in the transfer market. Uh, we'll take a quick look here. We've got uh, Christopher Zachariasen. Yeah, I'm going to butcher these names, but I think I got that one, uh, at least close. Uh, he's a defense, a center mid and an attacking mid. He's going to join us on November 15th in two weeks. That's the end of the season. Uh, we are, we've made an offer to uh, Pola, a 25-year-old, uh, again, central midfielder. He can also play right mid in the 4-4-2 that we're playing and attacking mid if we need to develop that. Uh, let's see. Arnor Smarison, 31 from Motherwell. He's going to join us on January 1st uh, for $350,000. Uh, he is another central mid and right mid and attacking mid across the board. So he can play right and left. That's why I went after him, played a lot of positions. Oscar Johansson, we've got a contract offer out, 24-year-old. Uh, again, central midfielder and attacking mid across the board. And a 17-year-old Jonas jo jo uh, Jovanovic, maybe. We've got a contract offer out to him. He's a youngster, and we've got a couple of staff offers out, which I'm not even dealing with. Um, we have decided not to renew a few players just because of uh, their age, their salary, uh, trying to get a little bit younger. And anyway, uh, also we have... Fallen to eighth in the table. Kalmar uh, got a victory and moved ahead of us by three points. So we've got one game in hand. So we're going to be trying to catch up. And we're trying to stay in that eighth position or better to finish in the top half. Hopefully if we finish ninth, we don't lose our job. with you know. But this will be the last episode of this season because there's only two matches left. Also, I had asked the question... And if anybody here is from Sweden or speaks Swedish, by all means, help me understand what the words mean because I don't know what they mean. But I had asked what IF meant. So let's pop down here real quick. And IF basically means, uh, shoot, I had it somewhere else. Basically, it means football club. Sports club and football club all combined is what it means. And then I found this article. Now, granted, it was from April 2009, but uh, the first thing many newcomers to Sweden will notice, I don't know what this means, but I guess that's the nickname for the premiership, uh, is the low playing standard, schoolboy errors and comical goals. Uh, so I thought that was hilarious. So we'll see. Anyway, back to it. Let's get into the match. Uh, we are four to six favorites here over uh, Football Club Brage. And let's go into team selection. I'm going to play that tactic again. All right, Tankovic. All right, Finger got hurt, but he comes back tomorrow at full strength. So that's not going to hurt him, I believe. Defensive center right. Where's he at? There he is. Oh, defensive center. Duh, I was looking up here. All right, so he's here. All right. Uh, well, let's get to it. Hopefully we can pull out some points. All right, we are going to be in the green kit again. All right, get to the dressing room, do it for the fans. Yeah, whatever. All right, we're in the green and white striped kits. 
they're playing a similar tactic, it looks like. Oh, Petrie plays it out. Oh, it's a trip fest. Oh, there's a shot from range by a lot of Sami, maybe. A lot of Sami. Oh, there's a save by Bolstad. All right, so we're off the mark with a couple of shots, one on target, one off. A couple of long shots. Everybody's playing pretty reasonable so far. Six nil on shots. Four long ones. Hmm. All right, here's a highlight for Bra Braja or Brage. Oh, cleared out. Very nice. Petrie huffs it through the middle. Come on. No. Keeper made a nice charge out to block that. Oh, there's a long through ball. Yellow card on Hamad. That's one of our guys. Speak of the devil, chips it into the box. Tankovic to Petrie with the finish. And we're up 1-0, 38th minute goal. Oh, he was off sides. Yeah, he looked it. Oh, there's that comedy of errors. Right? Yellow card, that's on their side. Should be coming up on the half. All right. 58% possession. All right, yeah, we are disappointed. You need to watch your step. Um, and attackers. I know you're capable. I don't know that for a fact, but it seemed like the right thing to say. <laughs> All right, seven to nothing on shots, fifty-eight forty-two on possession. Oh, there's a deep ball, Severson. All right, how do you pronounce the A E combo? What's the what's the right pronunciation for that? Again, I'm probably going to butcher the pronunciation anyway, but. I figured it would at least be courteous to ask, since I know that's a common thing in uh, S Sweden. All right, building it up. Oh, there's a nice through ball. Hamad bounces it off, sets up a corner. Three on, three off, three clear-cut chances and not a goal yet. Ugh, brutal. Oh, yeah, just pass it back to the keeper. You know, that's okay. It's their turn. Their turn. All right, we need to get creative, guys. Come on. Nobody's really tired yet, but... Boy, that was a slow pass back. If we had a guy with pace... Oh, look at this. Oh, what a steal by Kevin. And he puts it in the goal. He was home all alone. All right, we're going to sub out now. Um, he's playing well, but I don't want to risk the yellow. So Leo Binkson, we'll put him in. Nobody's playing horrible. All right, so let's pull finger off. Marcus Nielsen. We'll put him in, get him a little playing time. All right, we really need to get, all right, well, they're certainly not beating us over the top. Looks like we've got the pace to, uh, to really control any type of attack like that with this club at least, right? Oh, there it is. Ala Desomni. 
There's the uh, there's the game winner, I think. Petrie with the pass. Wow, that was a very nice dish. And the keeper's like, holy crap, I didn't stand a chance. All right, let's sub off one more. Gershon Coffee. Yeah, let's bring on the coffee man. And Brad Baggio Husidic was a little tired. So, yeah, there we go. The coffee man. If he can't do it, no one can. Oh, crud. Tankovic groin injury. Five minutes of stoppage time. Did not need that with a torn groin. And they're going to let him take the corner. That was stupid. All right. Well, we get the win. Two nothing. Hopefully he's not injured badly. We're back up to seventh. And I think that's the best because we only have one match left. We cannot catch Hocken. Um, and I don't think Goatbird can catch us. Now, <laughs> In that article I was showing you a second ago, they actually referenced uh, IFK Goatberg as the Manchester United of the of the league. But they said because it's a smaller league that their best players get poached regularly by England, by the Premiership and, and what have you. So, you know, there's really not the depth of talent uh of homegrown players, and I don't know if they just don't bring in a lot of players from outside or or what the case may be, but, you know. Anyway, that was some interesting reading. All right, to the dressing room. We appreciate your efforts, and we'll leave the match. We'll see how bad uh, your boy's groin is hurt. Let's finish out the day. <clears throat> All right, now they are one of the worst defenses. We shut them out on shots. That's interesting. Five to six days for the tank. And a lot of Sanmi. Wow, that's a that's a tough one. 20-year-old striker. Superb up front. Keep it up. One thing I've learned, at least that I think I've learned, is when you get the email about this, that's when you praise them. If in the email that kind of gives like the wrap up and you have like all the information and then way down at the bottom, it says these players deserve praise for their form. I don't praise them there anymore because I always seem to get, you know, crap responses from uh, from players on those. So I only do it when I actually get the email like this one. All right. Uh, let's see. So schedule wise, we play Homestad's BK. They are 11th in the table. Kalmar plays Jirgadens, and they are 5th in the table. All right, so that could work in our favor. Oh, squad dynamics. The leadership, they said that our reputation is quite low. And now one of you guys made the, made the comment you were surprised I got a job in this in this division. As was I. I wasn't expecting it, but I think they were so low on expectations that that's what got me in the door. So uh, I am training for my A license, my Continental A license. So hopefully that bumps me up and gets rid of this knock. Um, because you can see our locker room's very good. Match cohesion is doing better. And that's all just going to take time. So, uh, and if we look at the hierarchy, Hello. One, oh, one of my cats is over there. <laughs> uh, I have a lot of players that oppose me. Dude, I've only been here three games, and we've won all three. You should be kissing my butt, but that's okay. So I don't have anybody that supports me. That's okay. We'll, you know, we'll get there. Um, anyway, and I made some of the, one of these guys captain, man. What What is the issue? Oh, well. All right, our next match is in a week, so we'll be back for the season finale here in just a moment.
All right, we are back for our finale. Uh, in the week in between uh, games, I did go to the board. I did ask for a search for an affiliate club to send players out on loan to, and they agreed. And I also asked for a senior affiliate to get players in on loan from, and they agreed to that too. So going 3-0 and is worth something, I guess. All right, so to finish top half of the table, we are tied with Kalmar coming into this. We have the better goal differential, so we need to match them. All right, so whatever that means. We need to get a win. Or, you know, Basically, if we win, we, we finish top half. We're two to five favorites, and I'm, I'm hopeful. Uh, Hamad is suspended for uh, yellow card violations. I have uh, actually made an offer for end of contract to Al Alada San Sanmi. Uh, boy, that's a butcher name. Alada. Alada. That's it. <laughs> a lot of. All right, so we're going to go with our 4-3-3 just because I know that we can score goals with it. And, uh, yeah, so let's get into it. Hopefully we can win. Uh, we need a number. Number 30. Lucky number 30. Get her done, you know. All right, go out and prove a point. Everybody's motivated. Play some football. You know, I can't help now, but I was watching uh, the first Kingsman movie uh, with my son the other night. And, uh, you know, the, uh, the there's a Swedish princess that's taken captive. And uh, so... I always hear her voice. <laughs> uh, you know, anytime I'm thinking about the club now. All right, come on, boys. All right, we've got a 7-3 to three advantage. Oh, there's a long ball. A lot of Sanmi on the run. Crosses it back in. Oh, brutal. Oh, that was, okay. That was pretty brutal. They just couldn't control the ball enough to kick it into the empty net. That's... That's pretty pathetic. Okay. Yeah, I see where they're talking about the comedy of errors. That's okay. It's pretty funny, actually. Oh, look at that. That was a nice ball. A lot of sign me. I'm hoping we sign him because he'd be one of our top two strikers on the club at the moment. And I don't know why. He's been on loan, but he's only appeared in one match. So go figure. So, but his contract's up this uh, the end of this season. So, Orjansval, Orjansval, Holmstad. I I wish I could pronounce these because I know a lot of those names sound really cool, especially if you can say it in the right words, you know. But hey, eh, you know, it is what it is. All right, Petrie. Oh, Petrie. Oh, right to that dude, Binkson. Come on, fellas. Oh, there's some dangerous play. Uh-oh, uh oh Oh, it bounced in. That was like eight ball corner pocket off the off the gutter across the street. Nothing but net. Because <laughs> it didn't go straight in. Oh, we got a card here. Uh who who got carded? Oh, finger and capozo. Hmm. All right. Romulo's not playing great. Petrie's having a rough day. All right, it is it is halftime. There we go. All right, it was just a little sluggish. All right, yeah, for di disappointing. All right, you're playing a 6-7. Please don't get booked. Please don't get booked. All right, Petrie's at a 6-4, Romulo's at a 6-4, Castigran at a 6-5. All right, we're going gonna to stick with him for a little while here. I'm ready to make the sub, though. 
boot it away. There you go. I don't know who you were kicking it to down there, though. Uh-oh. Alho. He was involved in their last goal. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. All right. We need you guys to concentrate. All right. I think I'm going to pull somebody right now. Uh, do I pull Petrie? Maybe. You know, Tankovic. The tank is healthy. And let's go ahead and I'm going to pull Finger for Nielsen again. A little bit of an early sub. That's all right. Not over yet. All right. We give the set piece. Get creative. Come on. Oh, man. Capozo. I don't have anybody else that can play left back. All right. Romulo, you're out. I'm going to bring on Eld... Eld uh, who is that? Edland. There we go. Edland. All right. This is attacking. All right. We're going to drop into that tactic because we've been scoring some goals with it. Uh-oh. Missed the header. Got the ball here. All right. Push forward. Now, that's backward, not forward. All right. Tank, Eglund, Alada. Oh, there's a through ball to the tank. Can't get it in the net. You need to take it. I don't think they like to take touches. I think they're allergic to the ball. That's what I'm feeling here. All right. Severson. No. Oh, my God. My Leeds club would have eaten that alive. <laughs> All right. Come on. We got to make this one count. Make them pay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Did he give you $5 to kick it to him like that? That's not what I meant by make him pay. Not not quite what I was talking about. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Well, that's going to glitch the game. Not glitch the game. Seal, uh, seal the game. Seal my fate. Final nail in the coffin. Oh, their fans are going wild over here in the visitor's section. Actually, I think we're playing at their place. It shut up our fans in the in the in the end of the pitch. Oh, that's just gut wrenching. Come on, boys. Get one back here. Just. You know, just to make me feel good going into the off season, you know? Okay. Um we do have work the ball into the box. Shoot less often, shoot less often, shoot less often. All right, so, yeah, not exactly sure why they're shooting the second they get the ball, but okay. And there we go. My first defeat as coach of Hammerby. I hope I don't get fired. All right, Kalmar wins. We drop down to eighth. We do finish top half.
All right. I am not happy with the match. Leave the match. All right. Transfer window opens in a couple of days. Let's see. Disappointing collapse. Really? Okay. I mean, we had a one nothing lead. Is that a collapse? Or maybe. All right. AIK win the division. Edlin makes his debut. We get $60,000 for finishing in eighth place. Uh, does that help our finances? I mean, we're sitting on $13.7 million. That certainly doesn't suck. I am going to get rid of some payroll. Actually, we're well under payroll. $2 million. Now, next season, it's going to go up to that. All right. So... Let's see. Let's finish the day. And kind of play catch up here. All right. I'll go back and look at that. All right. The 17-year-old midfielder accepts our contract. And let's see. Schedule. All right. So we are done. Competitions. We are done. We are not in promo. I don't think you get promoted. What happens here? You qualify for Europe or something? All right. The top team qualifies for Euro European champions. First qualifying phase. Two through four qualify for the Euro Cup. Okay. Okay. And yeah, that article said they don't usually do well here either because they don't have the players to be very competitive. So, you know, they're uh, in college basketball terms, it, it would be they'd be a 16 seed taking on a one seed. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get to the end of the season, see what some of our awards are. Oh, and when does our season pick up? So friendlies are in March. So yeah, we're going to have a little break here. All right. GIF Sunsvald fire their coach. All right. End of season awards. Uh, Yeloan Hamad, 56% for fans player. Kevin Al Sanmi, goal of the season. And that was in his debut. And young player of the season is the tank, Moomer Tankovic. Uh, let's see. We finished eighth. We won in the second round of the Swedish Cup. Average attendance was 76% full, 23,970. So that's good. Leadership support, early days, but they're going to be take some convincing. Very good locker room. All right. Uh, let's see. End of season. We're going to finish in the top half next year. Yeah, I don't think we're quite ready to challenge, but that's okay. Clots. And yeah, we'll go we'll go uh, eight weeks. That's fine. That's a little bit longer uh, than England because usually we go five weeks in England, right? All right, the board sets the initial budgets. Transfer budget of 13.9 and payroll of six and a quarter. All right, um, before I get there, I, I, I'm probably going to want to put a couple of players on the list. Well, it's too late now. Yeah, you accepted that too late. So the season's over, dude. I don't have a week for you to come just hang around the office with me. And I don't know if that's the only awards or not. If we don't see another award today or tomorrow, then I'll just go look at stats. All right. Data analyst. All right. Let's just go look at stats for the squad. All right. So keep in mind, I had three players in my lead save score 20 goals in the same season. <laughs> All three of them. So we've got an 11 goal in 25 with one assist. So he's doing okay. Six and 28 needs to step his game up, but he should be able to. 
three and two. I hope that guy signs with us. Three and twenty-four. Well, you shouldn't be taking a uh, scoring a lot anyway. But I would like to see more assists. Our big assist guy was the tank. Eight assists in twenty-eight. And six for Hamad. So, yeah, I definitely expect to see those numbers go up next season. And it's good now that I've played, you know, now that I've played quite a few seasons um, under my belt, I'm kind of getting a better feel for what I need to do. Now, I still think I go out and sign too many players. And I think the problem with that is, I find it hard to get rid of players. Not that I don't want to, but because nobody wants to buy them. So I don't know whether to release them, if that's cheaper. I don't know what the deal is. But um, anyway, so what we'll do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, end the video. We'll end the season. I'm going to go through the, uh, the offseason here, transfers, see about revamping the squad for next year. And... Um, We'll come back with uh, with next season back here in the Swedish Premier League with Hammerby. I didn't get fired right at the end, so I'm assuming I'm not canned. So uh, that's good. Uh, oh, you know what? I guess we could go job security. And it will take a little while to boot this up since it's been a while. Uh, let's see. Oh, backwards. Swedish. First division. Swedish Premier Division. There we go. Uh, let's see. Here's all the teams. And we are secure. Oh, that's their stable. Stable job status. That's good. Very glad with that. Uh, very secure. So, yeah, it doesn't look like anybody's going to get canned right now. Except for... Malmo, possibly. I've heard of that club. Where have I heard of that club before? Did I sell a player to them from Leeds, maybe? Or maybe I bought somebody from them this year. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, uh, under review for Goatberg. Wow. So the Man U club's going to can their boss because he finished behind us. And Sunsvall is available. So a couple of clubs, but not, uh, you know, not a huge number. All right, guys, well, leave a thumbs up for the video if you liked it. Let me know what you guys think about being in Sweden and, uh, you know, what we, uh, what we can expect. If any of you are from Sweden, certainly chime in. Let me know about the club, the league, whatever else you guys want to mention. And I think uh, probably the other people would consider that interesting information, if nothing else. Uh, Nielsen signs. All right, guys, well, have a good one, and we will see you next season. Thanks a lot.